It's been a while since I've been out on the Fireblade, and this might be one of my last rides on it, you never know. My head's been turned by another bike, but I haven't actually bought it yet. I've been intending to make this for a while because towards the end of last year I put on some lowered pegs, lower and a little bit further back. And I rode it at the time and I thought, yes, they're a big improvement, and I still think they're a big improvement. But towards the end of this video, hopefully I'll have removed them and do another bit of a ride to see if I still think they're a big improvement. The problem that I used to have was when you set off, I struggled a little bit to find the pegs. Maybe the uh, angle of the you know, my knee wasn't quite what it should have been. And it just, I had to think about it and I found that a nuisance. So I bought the adapters to make the, uh, the pegs perhaps a little bit more accessible and I'll be honest with you, they're really not a problem now. I get on the bike, I don't even think about it. Now it does concern me that there's two issues here. One is, maybe I've just got used to where they are and that's why I'm not, you know, finding them a problem. Second, why start adjusting the bike anyway? Maybe I'm not doing the right thing in you know, adjusting a sports bike to be less sporty and maybe I should buy a bike that's, uh, you know, a little bit more comfortable day to day. I mean, I'm also thinking of raising the bars, so if I do that, I might as well go back to the sprint. So another bike's turned my head and I'm thinking about it. These lowered pegs, I feel gr are great. And if I'm keeping the blade, which I may well do, I'll definitely keep them on. Thank you.
even although I've fixed the footrest problem, I still keep feeling that the bars would be better if I was just there rather than there. And I keep thinking, should I raise them or shouldn't I? The footrest position is almost perfect, I'd say, for me. I could really do, though, with the bars just an inch or two higher. The lowest footrests make the footrest position on this bike not a problem whatsoever. You know, every time I ride it, I actually think the footrests are probably perfect. Now, that might not be the case if I raise the bars. Because if I raise the bars, it might mean that my knees should go a little bit further forward. These are all the kinds of things that go through your mind. It's at times like this that the footrests really come into their own. Put your feet down, and when you put them back up, you don't even have to think about it. You can spend all your time thinking about whether a car is going to hit you or not. At this point, if you're thinking that your footrests are a little bit uncomfortable on your gener this generation, the SC33 generation of Fireblade, I strongly recommend them. Honestly, the footrest position doesn't cause me a single issue. I put them on and it felt natural for me straight away. Having changed the footrest back on the Fireblade, I am more conscious of having to find them when I set off. And I suspect on a longer journey I'd be perhaps a little bit more prone to cramp. I can feel a little issue in my thighs. But overall, I could live with it. But for the, the sake of what they cost, they do make it so much more comfortable. So I think my vote is definitely I would I would put lowering pegs on. I think it's a good idea.